Okay, so good afternoon to the vlog. It's not morning anymore. Uh, we had breakfast and then a bunch of people went off to the pool and I kind of just went and did my own thing for a little while. Um, but I figured now we're gonna go explore. So I'm gonna take you with me as we explore this place because I've actually never been through here before and apparently you can't go that way. So let's turn around. Um, I wanted to go down to the beach. I think there's a party or rave or something happening down there because I don't know if you can hear it, but I certainly can. Um, so this is what the resort looks like in the day, by the way. And yeah, I'm still keeping the camera, you know, facing forward, just so that I can actually talk to you guys and be heard. Our room is that one. Um, and this is the Novotel Donna. Uh, I can't remember the name, I'll insert it if I remember. Um, so let's just go explore a little bit. So that's the um, name of the street, I guess it is, that we're on. Um, and down here is the party, and I'm wondering what the heck is going on, so we're going to find out. So this is the party that I could hear. Also, it's a bit windy right now, but um, I'm not entirely sure what's going on. I feel like this might be like part of the wedding, like there's supposed to be a wedding or something happening here. I'm wondering if maybe that's what this is all about. And then further down this way I think is the beach, so I want to check that out. I probably should have worn my other flip-flops, but I didn't think that through. Um, so let's go check out the beach. Like, what is this? I don't even know what this is. It's wild. There's like a full-on party happening. There we go. That's great. Definitely should have worn better shoes for this. Ah, this end is hot. Okay. Um, so it's like, I think when you, because I just got stopped by uh, a security person, I think when you leave or come out onto the beach, you're technically off resort property. Not 100% sure about that, but I think that's what he, that was about. Because um, it seems they don't want people like buggy people, it's a private beach. Because in India, I don't know if you've seen this, you probably have noticed this in my other vlogs, people come at you and try to sell you stuff all the time. That being said, there is a shop here. So, I don't know. This game is really cool though. It's like gray and also not gray at the same time. I feel like this is probably gonna be the lamest of the India vlogs just because it's at a resort. No, I've never filmed at a resort before. Um, okay, I'm gonna put the camera away, it's too windy. Who am I kidding? I definitely can't put the camera away. I'll just, uh, you know, cue the music. shows up on my screen right now because it's so sunny but um yeah it just it doesn't mix together and then you like step into it like that and make a big indent and then when it's wind blows it'll just blow the gray back on top and I don't know why it's like that but it's really cool and also please note it's not like that like over there and over here it's literally just down this middle row and I don't really understand but it's very cool to me I find this hilarious that this is called the Magical Forest. I mean, it is a little magical, but it's not exactly a forest. At least not the way I picture a forest. I think as a Canadian, I picture forests as like these giant sprawling bits of land with trees everywhere and like mountains and all that crazy stuff, but I guess this is a forest of sorts. Also a hammock, which I half want to climb into, but I also don't because I'm really bad at balancing in hammocks and I have been known to flip them many times and I have my cameras with me and I don't want to just leave my cameras on the floor, so let's not do that now, maybe later. Um, and yeah, now we're coming back to the villas, back to the thing. I think that that one over there, kind of behind the trees, that one, is actually my villa. But I'm not 100% sure. Maybe not. Greetings vlog, it's been a little while. We're going for dinner now at a restaurant that's like two doors down from our hotel. 
So we're just heading to the front of the hotel so that we can do that. It's actually really nice outside. And we've invited people <laughs> that we met. Well, I haven't met them yet, but um, some of the others when they were at the pool today met a couple other people and they were invited, so it should be cool. We're here at dinner. Dinner took a while to arrive, but it's here now. And some of the stuff has come to the table, but some of the stuff isn't here yet. I got pasta. I'm very excited because I really miss pasta. It looks like they're trying to sort out exactly who's got what. Um, but it's coming around. Slowly but surely. Here we go. There we go. We're done now. Dinner was great. This is a plate from dessert where I got uh, fried ice cream and it was wonderful. <coughs> oh my cough. Um, and now everyone's just figuring out their bills and I think after this we're going back to the hotel. Okay, so we're back on the resort. Um, we were joined at dinner by a lovely British couple from Manchester who um, everyone befriended. Like they were the ones I mentioned before we left. It's obviously night now. We kind of just semi snuck into a not wedding, but like the pre-wedding event, but we didn't actually like go in all the way. We just went through the back. Uh, um, <clears throat> I am very clearly losing my voice, so I'm gonna stop talking for the rest of the night and just rest up. So this is how I'm gonna sign off the video. Um, honestly, I feel like I sound a million times worse than I actually am. Like, I feel fine, I just can't talk. So that's it. We're gonna go rest up for the night, I guess, go to bed, and I'll pick it up tomorrow morning. Good afternoon to the vlog. I haven't really been filming today because I haven't really done anything today. I'm gonna go out there and go shopping, but I just spotted Anisha and my aunt climbing into the weird ball, so I wanna try and get this on camera if I can. So to, to get in, you have to like deflate it. And then they do oxygen. <laughs> They are almost inflated. She looks like an art piece in there, straight up. Run, go! <laughs> Anisha's going now, so it should be fun. You gotta run! Nope! <laughs> he was like, uh-huh, this looks familiar. Yeah! <laughs> So like I'm postponing my trip to go over there because we just found out from the Manchester couple from last night that there's a person over there, somewhere over there, that makes bracelets for you. Like you get to choose all the colors and everything and it's like 200 rupees, which is like 400, four, four, 400 what? Four Canadian dollars, which is like super cheap. So looks like we're gonna do that. <clears throat> I'm still losing my voice. And then I'll probably venture outside. I really, honestly, the whole reason I'm venturing outside is mostly just to get sunglasses because mine broke like last week and I really am getting desperate for sunglasses. So, hope you enjoy that little segment of people running around in the ball. Never mind, it seems like there's a bit of a lull. And so right now I'm gonna go out, see if I can find some sunglasses out there and then come back and get that bracelet done. Also, this pool is just really pretty and it's just nice. Okay, so officially outside the resort now. I'm gonna try and find some sunglasses. And these are the little shops here. So there's a bunch of, bunch of stuff, but I'm just gonna cross when there's no cars because that's like a rarity that, oh, there we go, there's a car. <laughs> that never happens. So the first store was kind of a dud. They did have sunglasses, but they were too small for my head. So that wasn't really gonna work. Um, there's a few more shops down this way, and then there's some back the opposite direction, so I'll check them out and see what they're like. Um, oh! Are any of these open? There's like a little road, but it looks like the stuff is closed. Okay, that's fine. We'll just keep walking this way then. Right, so it's been a minute since I vlogged, and basically I 
You know what? I think I can actually maybe potentially turn the camera on me for two seconds. There we go. Um, I basically went to, I, I don't know, can you hear me? Probably not. Let me just, never mind. <laughs> um, it's probably better for me to just be closer to the camera. <clears throat> well, I went, ooh, pretty flowers. Went shopping, got a couple things, uh, had a nice conversation with a nice shopkeeper, and now I'm heading down to the beach. I was gonna go swimming in the pool, but it occurred to me I can swim in the pool anywhere I want. Instead, I'm gonna dip my toe in the water, because I didn't do that yesterday. I really don't understand why I didn't do that yesterday. I probably should have, but somehow I forgot. So, I'm gonna go down to the beach if I can get through this. I think there's actually a wedding or something going on. Um, and then after that, I might go in the pool, go for a swim, and then take a shower, and then we're gonna go for dinner, but undetermined at this point. Literally walking the red carpet, courtesy of the wedding that's happening here. <laughs> um, a little worried about getting back. I don't know if I'm even allowed to be here right now, but nobody said anything, and I saw people walking, like tourists walking, so it should be okay. And if it's not, I'll be super quick at the beach and just dip my feet in the water because I need to touch all of the oceans. And here we are at the beach. Um, quite windy as it was yesterday. Let's do doggies. Um, but you've already seen the beach, so I'm not gonna film this too much. And I'll pick it up right when I, or when I, or after I, dip my feet in the water because I wanna touch all the oceans. That was really lame and I'm sick and I'm sorry. Okay, bye. Okay, so now that I'm further away from the beach, Show you these. I got some souvenirs, shell, shell souvenirs, souvenirs, what? Um, which is something I do whenever I go anywhere. I'll collect, you know, rocks or. Sorry, there was somebody there, and I don't know if I'm allowed to take them, but I did it anyway, and I don't want to get in trouble. But these are a little collection. I mean, I'm not going to keep all of them, but I figured I'd bring some because in case my cousins might want or something. I, I thought these were really beautiful and like. They're really sandy right now, I'm gonna wash them off, but with some of the designs on them, or like the coloring of this one, it's like a color I've never seen before, it's like sunset, or if I can flip it over, which I can't, but anyway, the designs on these are like, they're nothing I've ever seen before in terms of shells. Um, yeah, I'll show them to you like once I wash them off. It's been a minute since I've vlogged, um, but anyway, we're back at the same place as we were yesterday, which is, ooh, can't zoom in. Trying to zoom in. There we go. <coughs> and now we're just waiting so for food. Yesterday I got the pasta, today I got the veg sizzler. And it smells really good. And she got the same thing. And now we're waiting for everyone else's food. Okay, I actually remember to film it today. This is the fried ice cream, or the temporary ice cream as they called it, and it's really good. Dinner was great, and now we're heading back to the hotel. We're gonna see if we can get in on a wedding happening, but... We might not be able to because I think they're just still serving dinner now and it's getting late and... Car's coming, guys! That happens. And let's get oh, across the street. Got to cross the street really quickly here because there's lots of cars and they're scary. And they don't care if there's pedestrians. The last clip was super janky. I don't even know if I'm going to keep it in. But uh, we're heading back to the hotel now, which is right here, and dinner was great. We're gonna try and sneak into a wedding, but don't know if that's gonna happen because they're only just serving dinner now, so. And it's kind of late and we're probably all tired, so. Don't know if that's gonna happen, but this is the hotel we're staying in. I mean, you've already seen it, but now you can actually see the sign lit up. So there's that. So the bride is coming down now. We're all just like weirdly outside of her room waiting for her to come downstairs. It's probably a little odd, but they're coming. It's too dark to even really make it out. Well, you'll see when she gets closer, but they're going to come and get it to us. Straight up paparazzi times a thousand. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> So we're going into the wedding. Remember that entrance I showed earlier? Yeah, that's the entrance to the wedding. Oh yeah, we're definitely invited to the wedding. on camera for the first time well no I was on camera briefly earlier today but I don't think anybody heard what I was saying but we're back in the room now we went and saw a little bit of a wedding so I'll probably insert that footage um, before that we were at dinner and yeah that's pretty much it for today the goal has been super chill I've actually really liked it um, and then tomorrow we're here for most of the day and then we're hopping on a flight to go to um, Mumbai, which is our final stop on this trip. So between that, I'm gonna sign off and say goodnight and try and get some sleep and finish packing because I have to finish packing. Um, and it's blurry now, okay. But yeah, I just thought I'd do a quick zoom of the room. Even though I'm pretty sure I've showed this room before, I must have. Good, yeah, I did, because I fully set up the towels were really nice. I'm gonna go to bed now and hopefully I'll actually be able to talk tomorrow because I would really like my voice back. Look at the coconuts! There's a full, like a full on dance party square going on here with like water jets happening. What on earth? trying to be discreet with a camera. Okay, now I'm getting weird looks.